Hello everyone, welcome back. So children, today we will be solving lesson number 13 of your workbook that is Sultan Ghiasuddin in the Qazi's court. So let's begin. Question number 1, complete the following. Number 1, the Sultan was a dash. Answer, good ruler. Second one, the Qazi was an dash. Answer, honest and upright man. Third one, the guards refused to let the officer dash. Answer, go inside the palace. Fourth one, the officer could not return without dash. Answer, serving the summons. Number two, answer the following questions with a yes or no. Number one, did the Sultan want to kill the widow's son? Answer, no. Second one, did the Sultan have a deep regard for the law? Answer, yes. Third one, was the Qazi an honest man? Answer, yes. Question number three, fill in the blanks with words from the brackets to form the correct pairs. Number one, bow and arrow. Second one, needle and thread. Third one, cup and saucer. Fourth one, shoes and socks. Question number four. Give the opposites of the following words. Number one, eastern. The opposite of eastern is western. Number two, honest. Opposite of honest is dishonest. Third one, inside. Opposite of inside is outside. Fourth one, enter. The opposite of enter is exit. Then we have fill in the blanks with the correct articles A and the number one dash kazi was dash honest and upright man so the answer is the kazi was an honest and upright man number two he sent dash officer to summon dash sultan to his court answer he sent an officer to summon the sultan to his court number three when Dash officer reached Dash palace, Dash guards stopped him. Answer, when the officer reached the palace, the guards stopped him. Fourth one, the officer was now in Dash fix. Answer, the officer was now in a fix. Okay. Fifth one, he could not return without serving Dash summons to Dash Sultan. Answer, he could not return ser without serving the summons to the Sultan. Sixth one, Dash Kazi would not take him back. Answer, the Kazi would not take him back. Let's see the next one. Assignment number two. Question number one, write the answers to the following questions. Number one, why was the Sultan surprised? The Sultan was surprised when, we, when he heard the untimely call for the Azan. Question number two. Was the officer successful in serving the summons? Answer. Yes. The officer was successful in serving the summons. Question number three. What did the Sultan do when he got the summons? Answer. The Sultan read the summons and told the officer, that he would appear in the Qazi's court the next day. Question number two. Answer the following questions with a yes or no. First one. Did the officer give the summons to the Sultan? Answer. Yes. Number two. Did the Sultan appear in the Qazi's court? Answer. Yes. Third one. Did the Qazi stand up when the Sultan entered the courtroom? Answer. No. Question number 3. Add L-Y to the following words to form new words. Number 1. Loud. Loudly. Immediate. Immediately. Third one. Eager. Eagerly. Fourth one. Time. Timely. Then we have question number 4. Give the opposites of the following words. First one is untimely. The opposite of untimely is timely. Second one. Appear. The opposite of appear is disappear. Third one, respect. Opposite of respect is disrespect. Fourth one, sharp. 
the opposite of sharp is blunt we have open ended question write in a few words what you think about the officer answer the officer was intelligent and found a way of entering the palace after being stopped by the guards he knew that he had to do his duty and give the sultan the summons in spite of being frightened he was courageous enough to do his duty assignment number 3 question number 1 answer the following questions with a yes or no number 1 was the qazi's judgment fair answer yes number 2 did the sultan obey the law answer yes third one was the sultan happy with the qazi answer yes then we have question number 2 give reasons for the following number 1 the sultan hid a sword under his robe answer the sultan hid a sword under his robe to be head the qazi in case he had hesitated to do his duty number 2 the qazi hid a whip under the cushion answer the qazi hid a whip under the cushion to whip the sultan in case he had disobeyed the law question number 3 the widow was satisfied answer the widow was satisfied because she felt the person who had done something wrong to her had been punished then we have question number 4 everyone praised the sultan and the qazi answer everyone praised the sultan and the qazi because the qazi had done his duty and the sultan had obeyed the law even though the sultan was a ruler of the land then we have question number 3 give the opposites of the following words number 1 accepted opposite of accepted is rejected number 2 present the opposite of present is absent number 3 satisfied the opposite of satisfied is dissatisfied number 4 obeyed the opposite of obeyed is disobeyed open ended question what do you think about the qazi and the sultan answer the qazi and sultan both were honest and just people their level of integrity was very high next we have is an activity project after discussing write down in brief what your duties are as a student son daughter friend etc my duties as a student i must study hard in order to become an educated and cultured citizen i should be accurate in taking down notes assignment or homeworks i should study well as a son or daughter i should help on everything that my family is doing i have the responsibility to study protect and care for siblings care for parents as a friend i should care for friends i should help and support my friends whenever they are in need of something i should always be there for them So children that's a solution for lesson number 13 Sultan Giyasuddin in the Qazi's court Hope you like the video and if you like the video do subscribe the channel like it and share it with your friends who need it and yes thank you for your support take care of yourself see you again in the next video bye everyone